So we live out in the country and we've got a gate up this road. It's about 2,000 feet from here and it's too far to run cable for Cat 5 without having repeaters along the way. And we wanted to have control of the gate using the internet and using your app on your phone. Um, so what we've done is we've employed some of these ubiquity sending devices that'll let us extend our network that's available here at this location, this building, and beam it all the way up the road there to the other location. So as you can see right here, we've got two cameras on the left and right side. And then right in the middle there is a white antenna. And that's an access point that sends a signal, that's the master. And it sends a signal up this driveway uh, to a receiver at the other end. And it's got just a cat six cable connected to it, that blue cable. And that cable goes into this, uh, into this building and then connects into the network. And that's all it needs. It's a PoE run device. So power comes over that ethernet. You don't have to have any other electrical cable. And so once that was hooked up, we had to go down the road and set up an antenna so we have line of sight. And between these two locations, can't see it from standing on the ground here, but at the peak of that house behind me and then down there at the gate with an antenna that's only about 20 feet up, we're able to get line of sight ab above this rise. And uh, these few trees that are in the way did not seem to matter. So the signal's coming through. Um, and I'll show you down at the gate how that other end is set up. So here's the remote end of our gate, the remote end of our connection at the gate. And here's the uh, ubiquity transmitter, and in this case, the receiver, because it's receiving the signal from the internet source. And what I've done is it's just tie wrapped onto the pole. And then coming outside of it is a Cat5 wire here that I've put inside some conduit just because the, the UV is so bad here in central Texas that it'll just tear up all the plastic and the wires. So I ran it inside that co uh, conduit and I piggybacked it with another wire that's in there that's going to this next, I'm sorry, Nest camera. It's a Nest external uh, design camera. It's kind of neat the way they mount. It just sits on this uh, magnet and the magnet's what holds it in place here. So that way you can have an unlimited amount of angles that you can pivot it uh, around at. And uh, that Nest camera will be using the Wi-Fi signal that is uh, created uh, through this, this connection back uh, with these Ubiquiti connectors. And then uh, just hit it with a bunch of silicon to try to keep the water out of the inside of this pole and keep those wires from getting wrecked. And I go ahead and mount this up on the pole now and then start getting the wiring connected up. So here's what it looks like up on the pole. That's about a 20 foot height, I believe, maybe 15. Didn't really measure that pole, I should have probably, but and it's sitting a few feet off the ground. So I haven't got it all wired in yet, but plan to do that later on in the day. But you can see how it looks like there. And uh, hopefully that'll take the weather. It's supposed to be ABS plastic and rated for being outside, so see how long it lasts. But I know these things work. If you do them, set them up manually. Work like a champ. And uh, we'll get that signal out a couple miles. And in this case, I'm only going to go about, we're about 1,500 feet, 2,000 feet, which is too long for a Cat5 cable, but will suffice for getting internet out to this location. So now we got everything connected up and if I look at the uh, the app, it's showing red, meaning it's the gate's open. I press and hold, and then I get the signal from the gate, the beeper, and the gate starts to close. So this is great. We've been able to extend our network out to the gate and then be able to use Wi-Fi apps uh, to do things like control the gate and uh, have a camera up the gate as well. So hey, I hope this video helped you out. and. Um, Please like and subscribe, and that'll help other people find it as well. Have a great day.